if a sunny day seems boring. Just wait until you see what Zach Sharp saves for the rainy ones. But first. Usually what I have to do is. Uh, he has to get in. Get the right foot in here. There we go. Meet Dorothy. 10,000 pounds of storm chasing might, a tornado tank. The main goal with Dorothy is just to get closer to the storm. Because the closer they can get to this, the more they can learn, but not without risks. But this is a very violent tornado. Named for the character in The Wizard of Oz, Dorothy is made to go inside tornadoes. And just like her namesake, Dorothy here has a skirt, these steel panels which keep them sealed to the ground in high winds. She's built from an old van, heavily modified, very heavily. People must look at this thing and they think, wow, we're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> yeah, well, I, when we pull up, people are always uh, sort of scared that there's some nasty weather coming. She's the brainchild of the Iowa Storm Chasing Network, founded in 2008 by Ben McMillan to help keep Iowans safe after watching the damage that these storms can do. In the situations where we had people die, unfortunately, the word didn't get to them in enough time to get them to go to safety. With armor that can literally take a bullet and seats for four people, a team can analyze and track the storm inside Dorothy, all in relative safety. A lot of times you see storm chasers get awfully close to get video and footage, which is crucial uh, to provide that live ground truth. That ground truth helping give people in the way a little more warning. There goes the school! And we've seen those consequences, devastation this week in Lake City as an EF1 twister tore the roof off the high school. People's lives are turned upside down. But getting that close is risky. Just last year, a Hazleton man, Danny Murphy, was nearly killed when he was struck by lightning chasing storms in western Iowa. Or in 2013, three professional storm chasers from Team Twistex were killed, working to gather data on a tornado that hit Oklahoma City. It took a, a left turn, uh, which usually, it, and it's, it rapidly grew, and it caught them off guard. So even the most storm, seasoned storm chasers are not exempt from Mother Nature's furies. A memorial to that team is still on Dorothy's bumper. Men lost in the line of duty, McMillan says, like all severe weather deaths. You can't really put into words what it's like to see those types of situations. All you can do is try to prevent them more in the future because it's, it's tough to, to talk about. That's why he, Zach, and the other chasers need Dorothy to get a little bit closer to storms like this. Stay in the vehicle, though, okay? So you don't have to. It still keeps people safe. It still keeps people safe. We, you know, we advance those warning times, and so that way you have more of a lead time to get to that basement to protect your own life. And if we're being honest, the curb appeal isn't too bad either. Plus, yeah, it's sort of like the DeLorean look, you know? So it's old school retro right there. Michael Crow. <laughs> yeah. KWWL News.